Sabra Dipping Company, LLC is a U.S.-based company which produces Middle Eastern style and other food products, including hummus, tzatziki dip, guacamole, and Mediterranean salsa. All Sabra products are certified kosher and vegetarian, and are available throughout the U.S. and Canada. As of 2016, the company held a 60% market share for hummus sales in the United States, and was forecast to exceed $1 billion in sales in 2017. Topic growth The company was founded in 1986 as Sabra Blue and White Foods. The company was bought in 2005 by Israeli food manufacturer Strauss. In March 2008, Strauss entered a joint venture partnership with Frito-Lay, a division of the multinational PepsiCo Corporation. Strauss owns 50% and PepsiCo 50% of the company. In November 2008, the company announced the construction of a new $61 million plant in Chesterfield County, Virginia, expected to employ 260 people and come online in mid-2010. The company grew over 50% between August 2008 and August 2009. By 2016, Sabra had gained a 60% market share of hummus in the United States, and, through its co ownership and sales channels with PepsiCo, was close to $1 billion in annual sales. To parallel the rising consumer demand for hummus, American farmers have increased their production of chickpeas fourfold since 2009, harvesting more than 100 million pounds (45 million kilograms) in 2015, up from about 25 million pounds (11 million kilograms) in 2009. Topic Marketing During the run up to the 2008 U.S. presidential election, Sabra commissioned sculptor Kirk Raidmaker to create busts of candidates John McCain, Barack Obama, and Hillary Clinton out of 100 pounds of hummus. Sabra launched its first U.S. national advertising campaign in March 2009 with the Strawberry Frog ad agency. In May 2009, the company began a series of promotional events in which it recreated Mediterranean villages in 11 major U.S. cities. By 2015, Sabra had established greater presence among American and Canadian consumers by marketing a cultural movement based on a desire for people to experience hummus as an old-world food with new tastes close to what they already knew. <laughs> Boycott campaigns Until 2010, the Strauss Group stated on their English-language website that the company donated food packages to the Golani Brigade of the Israel Defense Forces. Activists in the boycott, divestment and sanctions campaign have called for boycotts of Sabra products over the donations. Student groups at DePaul University, Princeton University, and the University of Ottawa campaigned unsuccessfully to have their schools switch to alternate brands. <laughs> Hummus recalls On 8 April 2015, Sabra recalled 30,000 cases of its classic hummus after a tub in Michigan tested positive for listeria. 
Inspectors with the Michigan Department of Agriculture and Rural Development learned of the possible contamination by L. monocytogenes after routine inspections on March 30 at a Kroger in Port Huron, according to MDARD spokeswoman Jennifer Holton. On 19 November 2016, Sabra voluntarily recalled multiple humus varieties across the U.S after Listeria was discovered at one of its manufacturing plants, though the company stated the bacteria had not been found in any of its actual products. See also List of vegetarian and vegan companies <laughs>